So this is what the shoe's supposed to look like coming December 10th. What's up, y'all? It's your boy, Benja Angel, back with another video for you guys. Today, we're going to be taking a look, a early look, at the Jordan 11 Cherries that comes out this year, December 10th. If you guys are new to my channel, make sure you like and subscribe. And it will be helpful if you guys donate to this channel to help this channel grow. And as well, it will be very, very helpful if you guys pick up some Airvay merch to rock with your sneaks. So I'm going to put my merch in the description below so you guys can purchase some of my merch. But anyways, man, let's get on to the video. Here we have a early look at the Jordan 11 Cherries that comes out this Christmas or this holiday season. Tell me what you guys think in the comments below. But I want to give a I want to say something really, really quick about the comic section. So YouTube has been having a glitch lately. I can't be able like I won't be able to really uh, reply to you guys comments um, on my videos because YouTube has been having a glitch. So I recommend um, hitting me up on my IG if you have any questions, um, which is my Instagram it is Y R E V A 821. So Erevate 821 is my Instagram. Um, so it's Y R E V A 821. So if you guys want to know my Instagram, that is my Instagram. But now let's get on to the shoes, man. Woo! -hoo! These are fire. Um, the Cherry 11s, fire. Fire, man. Save up y'all money, man. Y'all might have to save up y'all money for this shoe right here. This shoe is fire. In person, fire. Initial thoughts, fire. Hands down, this is the shoe I've been waiting to get my hands on for this year. Um, so let's get on to the details, man. So the details, you see the nice jump man, like every Jordan 11, the iconic jump man on the side, on the main part of the shoe. Really nice. Love the detail. You guys know the history about the Jordan 11s. Um, so I don't need to get into that that much But here we have the nice mesh now. I will say on these they went with a nice mesh material um, On this shoe and I think the mesh fits really well and They have half mesh and have leather going on towards the upper here. It's like a leather material um, Which is it's not like a premium leather, but it's a good enough leather where it will hold you. You know what I'm saying? So the leather is really good. We have the red jump man Conic Jordan jump man. You have like the nice mesh going around the whole entire overlay of the shoe as you guys can see and get on to the medial side of the shoe. You see this nice, nice, beautiful, beautiful red cherry pan leather man. And I think that's what makes the shoe. And I personally dig this shoe a lot, man. So this is this is going this shoe gonna be a problem. AKA this shoe is going to be a problem. On December 10th. So save up your money, man. Save up your money if you want these jeans. On the tongue there, you see the nice Jordan logo. On the third spacing, really nice. I think it fits well with the shoe, um, like every Jordan 11. Um, you see a red jump in the middle there to give it that cherry feel. Going on back to the media side, you see, again, the nice mesh material, which, if you guys can hear it, it sounds good. It's good, good material on the 11s. Get on to the back. The back goes crazy, y'all. But the back, the 23, the 23 is not stitched in. It's printed on. So with the new 11s, they normally they print on the 23 instead of stitching in the 23. So just want to let you guys know that with the new 11s, they print them on. But the OGs, with some OGs, they did print them on, like the Concours and the Breads. They did print it. Well, nah. Yeah, yeah, I think the Concours they was uh they was printed on with the 45 on the back and the Space Jams I think had it stitched in. I could be wrong, um, but I know to my knowledge they had they all all of them had like a printed on and some was stitched on the back. But with these they uh they printed the 23 on the back, which I'm not mad at. I think it um it fits well with the shoe. You know what I'm saying? I like the white detail on the 23. Um, the back looks beautiful. And also the pan leather heel cup is really nice on the shoe. And getting on to maybe my favorite part of the shoe, the icy blue bottom. So I'm going to give you guys a close-up look. The icy blue bottom fits really well with this shoe, man. Um, 
in person, the blue pops, the icy blue sole, it looks good. I'm trying to tell y'all, the icy blue bottom looks good on this exclusive pair right here. It looks dope. Um, so tell me in the, <laughs> well, I can't say tell me in the comments, but hit me up on my IG, man, if you have any questions um, with this pair. Um, I personally think the shoe overall is dope. It's dope. It's dope. Um, I love the Cherry 12s, but for this to be a Cherry 11, it go hard. Getting onto the laces, you guys know, basketball net laces, like every Jordan 11. Um, really nice. You got that nice patent leather as the overlay of the shoe, which gives it that pop. Get onto the insoles. So the insoles, you got, you got like a nice red Jumpman insole there. Um, it's hard to take out, but there you guys can see the red insole with the white Jumpman. Um, like every 11, man, I recommend going true to size. So Jordan 11s go true. Um, never go up because normally with 11s, they might feel more and more like a pillow if you go up a size. So 11s, I recommend going true. Um, but yeah, man, this holiday season, Christmas Jordan, what you guys think? Um, are you guys copping? Are you guys passing? Let me know. But all I'm going to say is these are dope. Let's wrap this video up. But yeah, man, thank you guys for watching this video. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed how I show this shoe. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. Um, I'm posting this video in the middle of the day, so I hope this video does well. Um, but yeah, man, tell me tell me what you guys think um, on, on my IG. Uh, let me know if you guys are passing or copping. Um, and what is your favorite Jordan 11 of all time? Um, all I'm saying is though, these is gonna cause a problem. You know, these are gonna have a problem, um, especially this red, this red pops. Um, but yes, man, I, I have a exclusive look pair of the cherries, man. So this was the treat video. I think these are dope. These are hands down dope. Um, the retail price, get onto the retail price real quick. The retail price is 225. That is kind of steep for this uh, 11, but is it worth the price? Yeah, I guess if, if, if it all depends on how much you want to pay for them or how much you want them for the low. Um, but yeah, man, um, huge shout out to Kate for sending these over. Um, really nice pair. Really nice pair. Perfect pair of 11s. Dope, dope shoe. Um, yeah, man, I think that's it. Thank you guys for watching. And like I say at in all of my videos, stay safe. And always, and I mean always, have faith. BJ Angel, I'm out. Stay safe.